Hello and welcome to another takeover edition of the Savvy Money Show. And we're back with Disney, only this time it's more like a reverse takeover. Last time we spoke about Nexon, Disney taking over Nexon to shore up their gaming arm of their vast array of businesses. Tonight we're talking about someone taking over Dick's Disney. And you've got to remember that Disney has a huge amount of potential and businesses in it and myself. We can look and we will see her. Apple was looking into taking over Disney in a... Well, when it first hit a low of 79. Well, uh, the one thing that put it off was they agreed to pay the medical insurance of its staff furlough and they were ho hoping it would drop a little bit more. But right now they were trying to look into it we, we and we spoke earlier how uh, uh, Disney were having negotiations with uh, the president of Nexon who knows they might have just had coffee together but apparently it's been reported that they've were in negotiations and Back in January, it was reported that the uh, president of Nexon wanted to sell his business to free up cash, which he's 98% shareholder. Uh, well, if he'd done that, it would just make Apple so much more, it would just make uh, Disney so much more attractive for Apple. So, if we look at it from Apple's point of view, Disney is falling again. It has ESPN, it has Disney TV, which is taken over Apple TV, its main competitor. It has the parks, of course, it has the cruises, and it has Disney stores. It, it has all the diversification Apple could want in one fell swoop. And if it does buy up Nexon, I'm not saying it will, but if it does, then in one swoop with Disney's price going down, and I think it will hit between 82 to 89, which is only... Ten dollars over what its low was this year, and if it buys Nexon, them ten dollars are well spent. I think, from Apple's point of view, they get the South Korean and Japanese mobile market, mobile gaming market, because the they're the biggest mobile gaming producers in those countries they if they make them apple only games then there's i iphones will go up you have uh, espn which they have an app for already you know you, it just all seems to come together i think they're waiting to see if this next Nexon deal gets done. And if it does, and the share price falls enough. Apple certainly has the money to do it. They were talking about share buybacks and the dividends. But I think this would be a lot better value for Apple in the long run. You know, it wipes out its main competitor in the streaming TV market. And it gains 50 million customers and growing every time. It gets so many titles. 
it wouldn't have any access to it before. It would have so many gaming apps. It would just have so much. But that's for you to decide. If you've enjoyed any of the information in tonight's video, please hit the like button. It helps with the YouTube algorithm. Uh, please hit subscribe if you want to see any more videos. Please, uh, if you want to sign up for any free trading apps, use the link below in the description below. I realise it's not on height, sorry, I mean today. Uh, and please look after yourselves. Stay safe, stay investing, stay savvy. Bye.